you didn't know how to. I, sorry, but no, when you met the comedy, the commentary, you said you didn't know how to. How many people sent you an email saying, "I know how to do the spocker." Well, I, I what the oh, problem was, oh, I, I, I was improving that whole time, and so people were asking how it's possible to do the spocker to a man. Uh, uh, I feel really bad. You it's don't, like, actually. You, you like, stop hey, right there and go, wait, that's a terrible idea, and you don't try it. But see, that's the thing. As soon as I heard like you saying, I'm like, I instantly know how to do that, but I shouldn't. Oh, and so, and so the, I, I responded with like, it's possible. You just got to get creative. And so I don't know. That's that's uh, a Do not want Na- broke Nash. Uh, uh, <laughs> the term plasticity has to come into play. Uh, I am not so plastic- plasticity. <laughs> actually, there was a, there was a funny story about um, I was watching. <laughs> was, Ed, what is best in life? Shut up. <laughs> I was watching uh, X Men Two, and the whole the a major story of that is how Rogue can't get physically intimate with people. You know. <laughs> Yeah, and I cuts. walked out of there going like I walked out of there going and I walked out, I saw that with my brother and I was like I I could totally fuck Rogue. <laughs> and he's like what? But she'd kill you and I'm like I could totally fuck her and and he's like how? It's called body latex, baby. Yeah, I'm gonna say latex. Oh, Yay! oh. oh. I oh. <laughs> <laughs> Nash disapproves of this white. I'm not saying it wouldn't take some doing. I just I, I don't want to think too much about it. I'm just saying, with rubber gloves and body latex, you could work wonders. <laughs> I, I just I'm seeing Spoonie with a big grin on his face and other stuff, and no, no, no. Smile. No. I'm just saying, if Rogue really wanted to get her rocks off, so to speak. Oh. <laughs> if she really wanted to get. To get pork. And Spoonie is here to save the day. Yes. She could make his work, okay? She has to go all she has to do is go to a fascinations and say <laughs> and just describe the situation and the guy behind the counter would give her the hookup, okay? I think I, I think the film industry is still a little bit too innocent to get to that point. Give it ten years. <laughs> and besides that, besides that, let's just forget the whole body latex thing. Seriously, if she wants to get sexually intimate with somebody, throw the dude a handy, okay? <laughs> This does not have to get complicated here. Oh my god. <laughs> my mind. Oh my god. My mind. <laughs> <laughs> well, somebody in the chat said, well, you know, Xavier could do a literal mind fuck. Ooh. That's, I think that's too Okay, I, I, just just we don't try to, to picture just try and picture Ian McKellen <laughs> yeah. making happy noises and You'll be in the hell that I am right now. Patrick Stewart does not need to get it on with Ian McKellen. I'm sorry. Patrick Stewart needs to get it so. (laughs) (laughs) This is the stuff that fanfics are made of. God. (laughs) Somebody says, finally, the topic of the chat matches the image in the stream. (laughs) I'm just saying, Rogue is. Rogue is a really bad date, and she wouldn't be at all creative. Okay, that's all I'm saying. She's, I'm saying, like, even if you did fuck Rogue, she would be a really lousy fuck. That's all. Goddamn. <laughs> she pisses me off. <laughs> How dare you be uh, Nash, the brain bleach is over there. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think your mind has just been fucked multiple directions. <laughs> you know, I... You, oh, man. I, somebody, said, somebody said, would Rogue touching his dick give her one? <laughs> Sorry, I started choking. <laughs> she, got, she, gets, she gets my powers. <laughs> I used to be the worst person I knew. I used to be. Rogue touching a man would be Bible black all over again. Oh my! <laughs> I don't think we can top that. <laughs> when did I get to be the good guy? Jesus Christ! <laughs> You're not the good guy. You're the only sane man. <laughs> God. He's saying if she wants to get intimate with Iceman, Iceman could do an ice dildo. Some chicks dig that. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I'm reminded of, have you seen the Twilight themed dildo? Oh, God. I knew that was the That next you put thing. in the freezer uh-huh. to, to, to replicate the. the... <laughs> 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 you put, yes, it's, it's white and it sparkles and you put it in well, the, the thing. Well, well if, you, if you have any knowledge of vampire mythos, you know that they can direct blood to give them, like, the blush of life. So if they wanted to, 
they can make it functioning. For, but, but uh, you're, now you're bringing you're no, bringing just vampire the fact the that she freezes this. this. Because yeah, apparently am. Edward's dick would be cold. That's no, it's fanfic and all bets are off. I'm sorry. <laughs> it'd be like it'd be like you know when you're sleeping with somebody and their toes are really cold, except you've got that. It's a wiener. Well, uh, well, then <laughs> that we could, we could always bring up the idea of someone getting getting it on with a nose for who happens to have a, a fiscate on, and you know they instantly <laughs> flash it off as soon as they're finished and just. <laughs> We no. broke. Oh, no. Jesus Christ! <laughs> I've broken Nick, and now I've broken Nash. I, See, I used to play vampire, okay, and masquerade. and I, I masquerade and requiem. And I, either one, my vampires never fucked anybody because that's not what vampires do. <laughs> no, they well, don't. no, there is Therese Vorman. <laughs> <laughs> That's for those who've played Bloodlines. <laughs> I always like that. She's there, a dirty still, girl. 